today I'm back at Culver's to check out a little something different. I'm talking a little healthier. Let me get a salad. Let me get some grilled chicken. Let me try your soup. Yeah, soup at a fast food spot. Let's go. I'm on a mission to shine a spotlight on the killer food being put out by some of the baddest restaurants on the block. This is Big Mike Certified. standard for a fast food spot to offer something like a side salad you know what i mean like it, it's pretty basic i think the fact that this one's got some wisconsin cheese on it is a little bit different definitely a nice packaged put together some nice big old croutons on there let me open this bad boy up so big mike what are you doing you over at culver's you didn't order a butter burger you didn't order something like a fried shrimp nah family i didn't today I really was looking for something kind of home cooked, something pretty basic. I wanted to just do something at home, but man, I'm tired. I've been working late on my toy store, getting all these listings up and getting all these packages out. And I got a couple of things in the fridge, but you know, my kids are in school, so they're working hard, doing their thing. And we're just kind of like running rampant. I know you're like, Big Mike, you're supposed to be eating a healthy salad and you just poured hella ranch in there and I did. That was like my instincts kicking in just to like pour all the dressing on there, but I can eat around it. Ooh, big old cucumber up in there. Yeah, you just need a little bit of that dressing. I kind of went a little haywire, but I'm not gonna kill all the croutons. And it looks like the croutons took the main hit, so I could eat around it a little bit. This cheese is nice though. I really do like that, uh, that kind of like spring mix of lettuce. It's not just your standard iceberg romaine to kind of have some of that color in there. And then I'm able to kind of stir it up a little bit so I didn't have to get so much of that creamy ranch just kind of smothering it and negating the health of it. <laughs> you know what I mean? But to kind of get in there a little bit of that Wisconsin cheese sprinkled out. It's a big old bite. Mmm. <laughs> all over the face but that's something that should be in my face more I like that ooh a little tomato mm. they do also got a pretty nice buttery crouton I'm talking with my mouth full <laughs> but that buttery little crouton that they put on there that's a good bite and it kind of melts in your mouth not like a brick some croutons are like bricks this one, you kind of get into it. And smooth. I did pick up some of this here. Chicken noodle soup. Let me pop this top on it. Try not to burn myself, because it's warm. Let's see if we can see some of that smoke. Ooh, I can see some of it, but it ain't really showing up on the camera that well. Let me see. If I get my face in front of it, can you see it? It's all good, trust me, it's hot. Oops, it's so hot, I'm really... Look at that. Got your chicken, your noodles, your broth, your veggies. All right now, family. Get a scoop of that. Man, if you're under the weather and you don't feel like breaking out the bones and veggies and burning yourself, <laughs> no, and, and brewing up some home chicken noodle soup, this may just do. Feel my soul thing, thank you. And my lips saying, slow down, brother. <laughs> we ain't gonna be able to taste the rest of our food for the rest of the day. You keep eating that soup so fast without blowing on it. That is a winner. A little iced tea check. Palette don't really need rinsing. Palette's had a great rinse with that salad and that soup. It's been prepped and ready to dig into this grilled chicken sandwich. So I'm moving on 
getting ready to open up and enjoy my sandwich, I handed my soup off to my daughter and she made a good point. She goes, it tastes clean. It tastes um, not as salty as like a canned soup. It tastes very fresh. Grilled chicken sandwich. Looks like it's got its grilled chicken, little season, nice white meat, coupled with a tomato, some lettuce, some pickle, some mayo, bun check. All right, let me pull that sandwich out there, give you guys another little look at it. We got our bun, our grilled chicken, our pickle, our tomato, our lettuce, a little moisture on the bottom of that bun with some mayonnaise. That bad boy looks good. Let's give it a bite. I just dripped all over myself. It's all good, I ain't going anywhere but home after this. It's a nice bite. Grilled chicken is really lightly grilled. It is a completely naked breast, so there's nothing blocking you from seeing the straight white meat. Soft, tender, seasoned, just lightly seasoned, which kind of like the soup and the salad is where my head was at today. I didn't want a bunch of heavy, spicy, over salty, over seasoned food. I kind of just needed a little something just pretty straightforward. You know what I mean? That's what I was looking for today. This is the meal. This is a nice Culver's meal. It leaves you feeling light enough to order a little custard. That's what this kind of meal does. It leaves you room for some of this extra goodness. So, Culver's, Kingman, right off airway. Caddy corner to Walmart, Smith's Shopping Center. They did it again, served me up a nice meal. So thanks Culver's, thanks Team Culver's. Thanks for coming to Kingman. Thanks for doing such a good job, offering us up these, these cool alternatives to the standards that we've had up to this point. Um, and I'm looking forward to other places coming into Kingman, into Mojave County, and opening up your doors and offering us something cool and new. Cause that's what we're here for. All right, family, thanks for liking, subscribing, and sharing these videos. It really does mean the world to me. Do me a favor and hit them buttons down below. You know, throw your man a like, share this video, subscribe. If you're on YouTube, ring that bell. If you're on Facebook, follow Big Mike Certified Food Reviews page. If you're on Instagram, Big Mike Certified. Um, I put IGTV videos up there. YouTube obviously gets videos. Facebook obviously gets videos. But to tell you the truth, I would probably check me out on all three spots because IGTV gets certain edits of the video, Facebook gets certain edits of the video, and YouTube gets certain edits of the video. And some places don't get other places' videos because they just are formatted better for certain places. So, yeah, check your man out. Big Mike Certified. Just trying to shine a spotlight on our community. Just trying to shine a spotlight on the badass food being put out by some kick-ass restaurants. Till next time, family. Peace.